Hey YouTube, Mr. Rampro here again, and uh, this is my little knife accessory kit. One of those Plano boxes, you know, with the little lids that you can close down and stuff like that and lock it. And this is primarily what I keep all of my little lanyard accessories and skull beads and stuff like that in. I had a couple of questions about the skull beads and where I'd possibly gotten them and stuff like that, so I'll go ahead and let you guys know kind of the ins and outs and what I've seen so far. Um, I will hit on this real quick. These uh, titanium clips you can get pre-made from some of the uh, knife making websites and stuff like that. These are really great if uh, you want to dress up your knife. You just got to be extremely careful with the uh, hole patterns and stuff like that. Make sure that you measure it and get one exactly for your knife. You can get like two or three of them for like 10, 15 bucks or something. So they're solid titanium. You can anodize them if you wanted to. Um, there's little to no grip on them the way they come so I kind of pinch them down a little bit more right here and get you a little bit better tension on there and um, this here will be kind of uh, this is that little mod that I was doing where you just take the end of like a 45 shell cut it off and rivet it to the uh, pocket clip drill a hole hopefully center this one isn't center a couple of them aren't but either way um, put it in the center put a regular aluminum rivet in it and just uh, pound it with a hammer and you're pretty good. It kind of resembles the uh, primer in the center there. And then I just put epoxy over the back side just to keep that uh, smooth transition. So when you're uh, deploying it out of your pocket and stuff like that, you kind of have that as a good, you know, just a good system. So that way it's not hanging on anything and stuff like that, just for fast deployment. But just wanted to show that again real quick because it's in here. Um, of course, there's various screws and little uh, tweezers and all that crap from the other knives. These here is the main focus, little uh, skull beads. And these things you can pick them up extremely cheap, especially off of eBay. You can get fairly big, uh, fairly decent sized ones, I would say. These here, I was trying to see if I had something to reference it to, but I don't necessarily have anything right beside me. Um, these here are a little bigger. You'd have to open the hole up if you wanted to put 550 cord through it. These skull beads here, I think they're called the Gothic Skull, if you look it up on eBay. And uh, those are pretty sweet. So got quite a few of those. And then uh, the bronze brash, uh, brass looking skulls are pretty cool. I know it's probably fuzzy as heck. I'm extremely close. I might have to back up a little bit just to get you guys a little bit better uh, viewing. But um, yeah, these things can all be had for extremely cheap on eBay. And that way you don't have to spend a freaking fortune on some of these other websites that have these knife lanyard skulls and stuff like that and if you want that same look and everything you can get all these little pieces and bushings just from different stuff I mean you can find these on jackets and stuff like that and kind of dress up your knife with the lanyards and everything so it's a, a pretty cool little deal um, I don't really like to EDC them with lanyards but I like the lanyards so it's kind of one of those things depending on my mood for the day I will say uh, make them easily removable like with these here for the little uh, Swiss Army knives, just putting a split ring on it and adding the skull. That's kind of a simple little thing on the uh, slip, on the smaller knives to do. But you can remove it. So at any given time, if you don't want it, you can take it off without having to cut it and kind of ruin your lanyard. So I've got a couple of lanyards I probably should have grabbed and brought in here that are pre-made, and I kind of bounce between knife and knife. So uh, that's pretty much it, guys. Just kind of wanted to show the options out there. And uh... <coughs> darn, bless me. Um, just kind of show the options and everything like that and kind of what I'd had all of these up to about three bucks or so I think that's that's a piece and I mean you're talking fractions as to what you would pay if you went to some of the higher-end knife shops and got them you know the ones that Emerson sells and stuff like that they're all fairly close and um, look extremely cool you can kind of dress up your lanyards pretty easily so I would definitely uh, recommend it um, to anybody the storage is working out pretty good and uh, that's really it just kind of a quick quick update video not really anything other than just uh, showing a couple of these beads because somebody asked something about them so these here are uh, fairly large like I said you have to open the holes up for the most part all the rest of them even the little ones have uh, pretty good feed for uh, 550 cord so that being said you guys have a great day and uh, we'll talk to you later